First of all, you need to open Sketchbook app on your iPad. Then, follow the instructions below. You want to import from your camera roll your image that you have saved. Down the right hand side here, you can see where your layers are. So just now I am working on my first layer. If I tap this here and the plus button, I then create another layer every time I press the plus button. I'm now going to click on import image and import this image from my camera roll. So if I press the little tick button, that allows this image to be placed on top of my first layer. If I press this little slider along, it changes the transparency of the image. So I can now see my original layer underneath and I can also see where this image is. And by pressing that button there, I can move around my image just by moving it around with my fingers and place it in exactly the positioning that I want due to being able to see through this transparent layer. Once I've got it in place, I'm then going to select the tick button again to place it on top of this layer. Now I'm going to press the tick button because I'm happy that I've got this positioned where I want it. But now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to my tools box and I am going to make this now look less transparent, but I want to get rid of the white background. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my little paint pouring pot and I'm going to pour transparent layer over the white. This is going to allow me to see the green da -da, background behind. Okay. If you wish, you can add on extra textures, shapes, patterns and colours using the library of tools. Here I am using the rubber tool just to rub out some of the pieces of the background of my second layer that didn't originally disappear with the transparent paint pouring. To go back at any time and change the positioning of this, I can simply click on the layer and then go up to the tools and move around my image, making it smaller or larger. Try and place it somewhere that's going to look interesting and obscure the perspective even of your final composition.